So question here is, does automating social media posts um, bad, is it, is it, you know, is, is automating bad for the algorithm? Uh, nobody knows for sure, but we as some experts are, um, are, are somewhat leaning there. So, so what I'm saying here is that um, why, why might it be bad? Algorithms care about human interaction, right? When people automate social media, they tend to be um, disconnected as you know, disconnected from real time feeling of, of what they really want to say, you know, authenticity, in other words, the audience can sense that they engage less. Therefore, the algorithm doesn't doesn't like it as much. Now, now it uh, does the algo also somehow punish third party posting, you know, third, third, third party service posting, like um, Hootsuite, you know, etc. Right? Does it does it always does it do that? Um, nobody knows. Nobody knows because the algorithm is secret. So we don't know. But but I have noticed, you know, I have noticed uh, downgraded downgraded um, engagement with automated automated posts from third party party sources. But it's like I said, it's likely because people get lazy and they, they um, automate too much. You, you, you see what I mean? Like if, 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 um, if, uh, if, um, if I'm just, what, what I mean by this is like, I'm like, wow, there's, I got a service that can automate my social media. So why don't I just automate? This, this is a popular post. I'm just gonna automate. I'm just gonna have a repost automatically every three months. Why not, right? It's, it, was, it did well in three months. It's plenty of time in between. Just going to automate it. So you see, human beings get lazy. It's so easy for us to think that way. But then once you start thinking in the automation way in terms of content creation, there's a disconnect between what a human being would actually say, well, this is what I want to post today. Or not even today. I'm not saying you have to literally be typing and po clicking post at the moment you wanted to go out. There's nothing wrong with using... There's nothing wrong with using scheduling tools. I'm not saying that. What I'm saying is, is it connected to what do you actually feel in resonance with your audience today or this week? I, I, I usually schedule my posts. I, use, um, I just use the Facebook, Instagram scheduler. You know, they have the, the official creator studio scheduling uh, tool. I don't use SuiteSuite or anything else. I schedule stuff, but it's what I actually want to post this week. Rather than, oh, it just, you know, meet Edgar or post recur or other services just automatically put something on there. And I think your human audience can sense that it's not really you there for some reason. And so the algorithm tends to punish that because the audience is the audience pun punishes when I say punish. They don't, I don't mean they are punishing you. I mean that they just sense something is not quite authentic. They just scroll by and that scrolling by action damages the your algorithm. Right, because when they scroll by and don't engage, they damage the algorithm. And so over time, I think the algos have noticed this and tends to, yeah. So the bottom line always is engagement increases algorithmic reach. That's it. And not just engagement, the speed of engagement and the quality of engagement increases algorithmic reach. So yeah, so anyway, I hope that helps.